Hi, my name is Rhys, I'm the Managing Director of The Door. Welcome to our website. I've put this video together for you really, really quickly to explain what we can offer you as a way of a bespoke, space-saving door. So we make all our doors to order and we can make them up to two metres high or a metre wide and they can cut any height in between and um, we, we do this in a couple of options. So Tam Door is our tamper door and it's made out of ABS plastic slats and it's backed with a, an aluminium handle. It gives it strength. An ABS plastic uh, tamper door is very different to uh, the uh, cheaper PVC that you would tend to find in the market. The ABS is flame retardant. It's uh, more rigid. It's still lightweight, but it gives the tamper door a lot more strength. It tends to retain its colour a lot longer than a PVC and when the door slides on its tracks you would tend to get uh, less squeaking and it would slide uh, a, a lot easier. When, a, when PVC gets warm it will tend to squeak and it will be a lot harder um, to push within its tracks. So like I said we can do up to two metres high um, and any millimetre in between and a metre wide I say there's three different options of track that we offer depending on the type of project that you have. So if you're looking at doing a, a camper conversion, um, an RV conversion, and you want to use it as a shower door, so you can use the standard track. So the door would sit on this standard straight track and you can have a 90 degree corner and it will slide across and inside along the side wall. Or if you've got enough space, it can just slide directly across on straight track. So that track can be bonded onto your shower tray and bonded or fixed uh, above. And that will hold the door in place as it slides across. The other solution we have for a track is a flexible track. So that will give you a nice curved finish um, when it's closed and it can slide across. With a flexible track, you can make your own 90 degree corner or just off on the on the degree of corner as it slides inside so you might have a complicated um, shower tray and um, our, our flexible but rigid track will be bonded to the tray and bonded above then and it will slide across so tamp door just sits inside the opening in your opening area and you would have the track fixed top and bottom and it slides inside we also do a vertical option as well so we you can use different track as well but the three track that we have and recommend a surface mounted track with our u-shaped spirals so it's surface mounted so it gets fixed either side and the door sits in and as it slides up and over it slides into a u-shaped spiral so if you look at our vertical option on our website you'll see the spirals and um, we can go to a maximum of 1600 mil high on our vertical lifts and they are gravity held so you would lift them up and they'd hold within gravity and then you'd pull them down so it's either a full open or a full close you can fix a latch behind the door so if you want when you lift it open you can fix the latch and you can hold that door in place as an added security or safety if it's a space that you're constantly working in and out so if it's for a cupboard um, you'd, you'd recommend fitting a latch our other option is roll door, really, really popular in uh, camper conversions for a shower door use as it's waterproof. So it's an aluminium frame. It comes in 10 different colours. It can also be made up to any millimetre height, up to two metres, and any millimetre wide, up to a metre. And there's four different options of fitting this door. So like I say, it comes in 10 different colours and two different colour screens. So one is a light grey and the other option is beige. So the four different options is uh, option A, which is the cartridge facing outwards. So if you're facing your opening, the cartridge will be facing outwards and it will be on your left. If you, um, you want the cartridge to be on your right and facing outwards, that's option B. And then if you want the cartridge facing inwards and you want a flush finish when you're standing outside. So if you're standing in the shower looking out with your cartridge on your left, that will be option C with your waterproof layer facing you. 
and with the cartridge on your right as you're looking out that will be option D with your waterproof layer in front. So a roll door can be either fitted within a timber frame like a camper van conversion and it could be um, our measurements are the external measurements top and, and width so right up to the edge so you can measure right up to the edge top and bottom and then that can slot into your um, timber frame and then fixed uh, we've got different videos online and on youtube how to fit and different customers who've fitted our roll door in, in different ways but those are the four options that we have um, they're, they're really really popular and um, they they are easier to fit than a tamper door because they have a cartridge uh, which rolls the fabric into so if you've got a camper van or rv shower room and you don't have much space in behind you or if you're fitting uh, or you you've made a wardrobe or um your own storage area and you've got shelves and you want a tamper door but you've got no space for the door to slide in and um, because your shelves are in the way the the roll door is a, is a great option because it's all within one frame so there's very little depth to it the other option is our net door. Net door is a pleated ma uh, mosquito net screen. So very similar to roll door. It has an aluminium frame and it comes in 10 different colours. And it can either slide to your left or slide to your right in, in a square frame. And the, the track at the bottom so is a very low track. Uh, it's a trackless. So as it slides, um, you, you don't have much of a step to step over. So yeah, they're great for... Um, RV camper van conversion so if you want to put a frame at your opening if you have a, like a large spin, uh, sprinter or crafter you can put a timber frame around the opening and this can sit within that uh, timber frame fixed to it and that will stop any mosquitoes or um, bugs getting in uh, to your camper van um, they're very popular um, they can be used as um, large windows or back doors to stop the flies getting in um, or mosquitoes getting in and they can be made to the measurement of your your opening at your your back door or your window so that, that's a, a great option for you the um, other option that we have it's just a new product called van door so it is a mosquito net a screen it has two layers to it the the internal layer is a mosquito net with a central magnetic open the outer layer is a waterproof privacy layer. So we have two different sizes. The smaller size would fit your T4, T5, T6, the Vero traffic um, size vans. So the screen would tuck into the weather strip all the way around the opening. And you can have that either on the side or your rear. The, the, the screen will fit either, either option. And once it's tucked in, it can be trimmed off and um, you've got different options to have the waterproof layer down where if it's raining of an evening and you want the van doors open to keep some cool air in the van that will, waterproof layer will protect any rain from getting into the van and that can roll up and clip away and then you're left with your mosquito net so like I said you can walk in and out and the magnetics will um, close behind you um, and when not in use that can also zip up and clip up at the top and then you're just left with your your surround in your rubber um, so there's a few different options there the, the larger one would fit your crafter um, or sprinter uh, for transit larger camper vans so we've got different measurements on on our listings you can see what uh, size is suitable for your uh, camper van uh, if you're unsure, please drop us a message. We're available on live chat and WhatsApp. We have our WhatsApp number on the website or our email address. Um, please send us a picture of your project if you're um, unsure how to measure up or you're unsure what type of door um, you need, but you know you don't need an outward swinging door. You need a, sli a sliding door for a, a small space. Then please drop us a message and we'll try and give you an idea of what door would be suitable for you. So we have if set sizes on, on our website. If you can't find the size that you need, we do have an inquiry form for sizes and you'll be able to see that on our website. And 
there's a few questions to fill out of what type of door and roughly what size. Uh, that'll send us an email and we can send you a quote um, for, for that door and you can purchase through that um, link onto our website. I hope this has helped and hopefully um, we can support you with any project that yeah, you'll get planned. Thank you.